Once upon a time, there were two people who fell in love while watching none other than yours truly on a little TV show. To celebrate the upcoming union, the bride-to-be messaged me via the YouTube, and then by email, and then by my Facebook fan page, and then by my personal Facebook page. Once I locked all my doors and windows, I decided to email her back. After a series of emails and phone calls, two parties signed a legal binding contract. The terms of their agreement involved two main points. One, true love. Two, my ball. Welcome friends, family, and totally random hired strangers. We are gathered here today to witness and celebrate the union of my good friends, Jason Lottermilk and Victoria Ribeiro in marriage. Under normal circumstances, a marriage contract is not to be entered into lightly, but thoughtfully and seriously with a seldom recognition of the obligations and responsibilities that go with it. These are not normal circumstances, and this is not a normal couple, so we're going to do it a little differently today. As your guide through today's ceremony, and as a personal, close friend to Jason and Victoria, I can assure you, though, that these two crazy kids seriously do love each other. In fact, I would say they were made for each other. For these two, the extraordinary has happened. Once they were just friends who happened to share the same birthday. They attended a prom together in 1992 as friends and then went on to live separate lives for almost 20 years. In 2011, they enjoyed an unexpected reunion and realized they shared much more than a birthday. They fell in love. So today we come together not to mark the start of a relationship, but to acknowledge and strengthen a bond that already exists in a way that makes complete and total sense for both Jason and Victoria. Their true love is something to behold. It is a love punctuated daily by laughter and nonsense. It is their desire to love each other for life in the spirit of this nonsense that is that we are creating and sharing in this moment here today. Now let us on, go on with it. Please face each other and hold hands. Jason, repeat after me. I, Jason Loudermilk. I, Jason Loudermilk. Take you, Victoria. Take you, Victoria. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. Even during a Dutch oven. Even during a Dutch oven. In, sec <laughs> in sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. Even though I have to stay fit and eat hippie food. Even though I have to stay fit and eat hippie food. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. Although I hope you keep making money. Although I hope you keep making money. And to love and for as long as we both shall live. And to love and for all as we much <laughs> shall live. <laughs> Victoria, repeat after me. Victoria, repeat after me. <laughs> no. I, Victoria Ribeiro. I, Victoria Ribeiro. Take you, Jason, to be my husband. Take you, Jason, to be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. Even when I am in a giant fart cloud. Even when I am in a giant fart cloud. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. Even though I clearly have to do all the cooking to keep it that way. Even though I clearly have to do all the cooking to keep it that way. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. Unless I figure out how to monetize you better. <laughs> unless I figure out how to monetize you better. <laughs> And to love for as long as we both shall live. And to love for as long as we both shall live. Do you have the ring? There's no, there's no, no ring. No, no ring? I need a ring. <laughs> by authority vested in me by the American Marriage Ministries and the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. 
Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to present the new and improved, much more terrifying married version of Jason Ottermilk and Victoria Ribeiro. May you enjoy a lifetime of joyous ball busting together. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> 